space is referred to as the last unexplored frontier. Scientists and researchers have said that although we've done well to understand some of what the universe has to offer, there's still many impossible to understand secrets that it seems to hold just outside of our grasp. Every now and then it seems that astrophysicists uncover something strange about our solar system, and this gives us a glimpse into the vast unknown of our universe. A great way to pass time is by looking up towards the night sky, and looking at the wonders the Milky Way galaxy has to offer. Our ancient ancestors have been doing this for thousands of years, and it's allowed us to see some incredible signs. From constellations, calendars and mapping, the observations of the heavens had been useful for navigation, for understanding our place in the universe, and even for important markers of time and the passing of seasons. Not only does observing the cosmos make you realise how small we are, but it's also important for science. Space agencies like NASA are able to scan the night sky, and understand what's going on around our planet. This is good for things like near-Earth objects, Near-Earth objects are small celestial bodies such as asteroids that could cause harm to the planet. It's important for scientists to log these asteroids and study them, as they will most likely have many close encounters with Earth during their lifetime. The majority of these asteroids will pass by us and have no effect on our planet. However, some do pose a threat. Although we think of them as just space rocks that float around in space, these giant celestial bodies have the power to cause massive amounts of damage to Earth. NASA have currently said they're tracking an asteroid that will make contact with our planet on the 6th of September. The researchers have said that this asteroid is classified as a near-Earth object, and that it's currently travelling at over 31,400 miles per hour. If an asteroid comes within 1.3 astronomical units from the Sun, it's given the name of a near-Earth object, is added to the logs to ensure that it can be watched by teams of scientists from around the world. Sometimes these asteroids can go off their paths, which in turn will send them on a new trajectory. This asteroid is called 465824, or 2010FR, with the researchers saying that it measures in at just over 180 meters in length and 268 meters wide. Interestingly, this celestial body is said to come into contact with Earth's orbit within the next week. Due to its size, it's been labelled as the asteroid that's twice the size of the Great Pyramid of Giza. According to NASA, there are more than 25,000 asteroids near us of 140 metres in size at a minimum. Additionally, there are plenty of other near-Earth objects that could be a threat to our planet. One of these goes by the name of Four Vesta, and it's so big that it can be seen in the night sky as if it was hovering nearby. Thousands of these asteroids can be found scattered across our entire solar system. The majority of them can be found in the main asteroid belt which is located between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter. NASA are constantly scanning the sky for near-Earth objects, and this is due to the fact that many of these can cause harm to our planet. Scientists have recently reported that a massive object that could change our understanding of history is hidden beneath the Antarctic ice. These claims have caused theorists to speculate about what could be lying under the ice. This mysterious anomaly is believed to be underneath an area called Wilkes Land. The area is over 150 miles across and has a minimum depth of around 2,500 feet. Interestingly, researchers have suggested that it could be the remains of a giant asteroid. If this is the case, it would have been more than twice the size of the asteroid that struck Mexico 66 million years ago. This could help to answer one of the planet's most mysterious events. During the Permian Triassic, a massive extinction event happened. It caused over 96% of Earth's sea creatures and over 70% of the vertebrate organisms living on land to perish. This giant rock could have been behind that event. This mysterious anomaly was first brought to the attention of researchers in 2006. This was when NASA's satellites picked up on gravitational changes. NASA are always picking up on near-Earth objects, and although the majority of these will never come into contact with our planet, 
it's important to log them and keep an eye on them as they could change paths. NASA have also said it makes their job easier as they have trackers across the planet, and they have scientists that work countless hours in order to pick up on these celestial bodies. However, the worrying fact is that many of these near-Earth objects aren't detected until the last minute, meaning that if one was ever to go on a collision course with our planet, we wouldn't have very long to prepare for it. This is exactly what happened back in June. An asteroid that's been given the name of 2020 LD passed by us within the moon's distance, but NASA researchers didn't see this asteroid coming. It passed by us on the 5th of June, but it wasn't discovered until the 7th of June, meaning we are very lucky that it passed by us and wasn't a threat. It passed within 190,000 miles or 306,000 kilometers, and although that sounds like it's nowhere near us in terms of space that's really close, one thing astronomers and researchers have said is that it's important to conduct further tests. When they're first picked up on, the researchers are on a time limit to try and understand their flight path. Detecting a celestial body early on is essential to understand what its behaviour is like. Researchers noted that back in 2018, we saw more than 91 MS hits of different asteroids of all sizes passing by our fragile blue planet. The worrying thing is that out of these 91 asteroids that passed by us, only 30 of these asteroids were seen coming prior to their passing, and only two of those were discovered one year ahead of the near-miss event. This means that for more than 89 of the asteroids nearly striking Earth in 2018, only two of them could have been prevented with our current technology, showcasing just how threatening these large celestial bodies can be. As of right now, scientists and researchers have said it's important for us to be constantly scanning the skies. Just because we've logged thousands of these celestial bodies, it doesn't mean that everyone is accounted for. Some slip through and this could be dangerous. After all, an asteroid with a length of only a few hundred meters could potentially wipe out an entire city. It's also interesting to note that space agencies are working on ways to break up asteroids if they're on a collision course. So what do you guys make of this recent announcement that an asteroid the size of the Great Pyramid is heading towards Earth's orbit? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below, and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.